Look at each of the tables below and decide whether they represent a constant or varying rate of change. So big words here are constant and varying. If it's constant, it doesn't change. That would be um, a proportional relationship. That would be something that is a straight line. It does not change. All right. Um, varying means that the rate of change jumps all over the place. So to do this, I have to do again y over x, all right, and we're going to say that these columns are y, these columns are x, um, generally that's how they are laid out, x goes on the left, y is on the right. So if I start dividing, all right, and I'm going to not do too much of this because you can probably do it with the calculator, but all you need to do is start dividing 125 divided by 62, and you're going to get um, 201. 2.01, I think. All right. And then you're going to do it again. You're going to do 133. Yeah, you got like 2.016, blah, blah, blah. And then you're going to do 133 divided by 64, and you get... And you get 207. Okay. These are not the same number, so already you should know that this is a varying rate of change. It changes. It's not the exact same throughout the entire table. So all you need to write for the first one is varying, or I'll just put V. All right, so I'm going to do the same thing here. So I'm going to do 96 divided by 8, and you get 12. All right, I um, then have to go through the rest of the table. 240 divided by 20 gives you 12. 540 divided by 45 gives you 12. 960 divided by 80 gives you 12. So that is completely all the same, so we're going to say constant. All right? And I'm going to stop there, and I'm going to let you do the last one.